This video will guide you through the installation of your new Simply Put Sink Front Tray. For this project, you'll need a drill and a tape measure. Make sure all the parts you need are included in the package. Your first step is to locate the placement of the tray by marking the top of the cabinet opening on the back of the false drawer panel. Now remove the false drawer panel from the cabinet. Before you begin installing the tray, note the right hand and left hand hinge. Place the hinges inside the cabinet opening, one eighth of an inch back from the cabinet face. Also, make sure the hinge is even with the bottom of the opening. Mark the center of these screw holes and remove the hinge. Drill pilot holes one quarter of an inch deep into the cabinet and attach the hinges with the provided screws. Reattach the panel onto the cabinet. With a pencil, mark pilot holes for the hinge attachment on the back of the panel in the center of the hinge mounting holes. Remove the panel and hinges. Drill pilot holes into the back of the drawer panel, taking care not to drill completely through. Attach the hinges to the back of the panel using three mounting screws. Note that you may need to supplement the screws if those provided are longer than the thickness of your drawer panel. Lay the panel face down and position the tray one quarter inch below the pencil mark indicating the top of the cabinet opening. Center the tray on the panel and make a mark in the top of the keyhole on each end of the tray. Remove the tray and drill two pilot holes into the keyhole marks, making sure not to drill through the panel. Attach the screws, leaving the screw heads one eighth of an inch above the panel. Open both of the hinges and reattach them to the cabinet. Close the panel and make any necessary adjustments. If a hinge binds, loosen the screws and re-tighten. Open the panel and slip in the tray, aligning the keyholes over the screw heads. Gently tighten the screws to hold the tray in place, but do not over-tighten.